My name is Hannah Fry. I'm a mathematician and I'd like to begin with a confession. I haven't always loved data. Truth is, mathematicians just don't really like data that much. And for most of my professional life, I was quite happy sitting in a windowless room with my equations describing the world around me. You can capture the arc of a perfect free kick or the beautiful aerodynamics of a race car. The mathematics of the real world is clean and ordered and elegant. Everything that data absolutely isn't. There was one moment that helped to change my mind. It was in 2011 when I came across a little game that a teenage Wikipedia user called Mark J had invented. Now, Mark noticed if you hit the first link in the main text of any Wikipedia page and then do the same for the next page, a pattern emerges. So, the page for data, for example. Links from set to maths to quantity, to property, and then philosophy, which after a few more links will loop back onto itself. Now, the page egg ends up in the same place, and even that famously philosophical boy band, One Direction, will take you all the way through to philosophy, although you have to go through science to get there. The same goes for fungi or hairspray marmalade, even mice, dust and socks. It was a very strange finding and it called for some statistics. Another Wikipedia user, Ilmari, wrote a computer program to try and investigate this phenomenon. Now, he discovered, amazingly, that for almost 95% of Wikipedia pages, you will end up getting to philosophy eventually. Now, that's pretty cool, but how did it change my mind about data? Well, the pattern that Mark J discovered and the data that was captured and analysed it revealed a hidden mathematical structure. Because Wikipedia is just a network with loops and chains hidden all over the place. And it's something that can be described beautifully using mathematics. For me, this was the perfect example of how there are two parallel universes. There's the tangible, noisy, messy one, the one that you can see and touch and experience. But there's also the mathematical one, where I think the key to our understanding lies. And data is the bridge between those two universes. <laughs>